Hey everyone, uh, I'm going to be doing something new today on ARC. Uh, these will be separate videos from my main videos, but um, I was suggested by two friends on my PVE server to do tutorial videos. Um, I want to go ahead and give a shout out to them. It's Neck Eagle and Purple Fox. Thanks so much for suggesting this. This first tutorial video will be done on how to level up. Um, there are several different ways that you can actually level up, but when you're first starting out, the best thing that you can do is to harvest and craft items. So, I'm going to go ahead and go over here and harvest some things. And as I'm harvesting, if you'll watch, the arrow at the bottom is lighting up. I'm not exactly sure how many points that you receive every time that you uh, harvest things. But it's not really a lot. If you're smaller level, um, it can be a lot as you're, you're, you know, you're just building up. But as you get in higher levels, it gets much harder to level up. I want to point out, if especially if you're starting out, um, after you've gotten all your tools and everything, if you want to harvest rock, don't use the pickaxe. If you use the pickaxe, you get some rock, but you mostly get flint. You actually use the hatchet to get rock, or stone, whatever you want to call it, and you get some flint. If you use the hatchet, you'll get wood. Okay, if you use the pickaxe, you get thatch. So, I'm going to go ahead and harvest a few things so I can craft um, a few things for my house over here. Um, I'm already level 28. And majority of that is from not killing anything, but actually harvesting things and crafting the pieces for this house. Uh, if you're playing on mobile, you will have a two times boost if you don't have um, the primal pass. Primal pass, you have two times all the time. But if you don't, you have to watch an ad, and I think you get it for like 15 minutes. After that 15 minutes is up, you have to watch another ad to get two times boost. But that multiplies how many experience. That also helps you uh, level up faster. Okay, so I should have enough to build at least a chest. So I'm going to go here and I'll tap here and craft. And notice that it is highlighted yellow and see how much of a, an increase that I had on the arrow there. Do note that after you craft things, you don't get experience for placing nor demolishing. Only for crafting the items. So I'm going to go over here and I'm going to place um, this chest. And when I place it, you'll notice that it does not light up yellow. Okay. As you get higher in level, um, crafting things can be a little bit more difficult. You've already gotten further ahead. Uh, into the game so you don't have as much that you have to craft the best way to increase your level is by killing things so 
I'm going to go down here. I have a pike. So I found a dillo. I started to kill the trike um, that was over there. I didn't know that one was there. But I started to kill the trike and decided against it to keep from dying. But I found this dillo. And if you'll notice when I'm hitting it, it doesn't, die, uh, it doesn't light up yellow. But once it dies, it lights up yellow. That only works it, if you um, kill the creature. It does not work if you are attacking it. So killing creatures, um, harvesting and crafting items are some of the main things that you can do to level up. They're usually the easiest. Uh, another thing too, if you have a uh, item that needs to be repaired and when you repair it that will also count as experience points I'm not sure if it gives you the full month like you would if you were crafting something but I do know that it gives you um, some experience other ways that you can get experience to level up um, if you come here you have pursuits that you can do uh, they do have a daily pursuit that you can um, do every day. It, for me, it resets at 7 o'clock every evening. Um, but if you can't do that pursuit, there are others that you can do. Right now, I'm not able to do some of these, but I will go ahead and do the second little Theomia. And I have everything done as I had already built. All I have to do is just go inside and when it finishes it gives, gave me 250 XP and sometimes they'll actually give you a gift um, I'm not sure which one it is but I know that there's one that will give you a Mastercraft sword that was the best one ever and then I died and lost it but aside from that uh, if you noticed I did level up so to level up you'll go here to your backpack and usually it will automatically uh, put your stats and everything up. If you can level up, you can press this button here and choose whichever one you want to do. Um, I personally don't fool with crafting speed, water, and food. I mostly do the rest. Oxygen, I, I don't focus on as much as since you can be able to get scuba gear and everything. So since I've leveled up here, I will go ahead and do, um, let's do weight. So since I've covered harvesting, killing creatures, and uh, crafting items, pursuits, when you get higher in level and you're able to complete caves, those, that will also help you get experience. The harder the cave, um, the more experience you get. Going through these caves you have to kill a lot of creatures so you get experience from that plus you get experience by obtaining the artifact and making it out. You can go to one of these three obelisks, the red, blue, or well you can't see the green, and you can go there if you put the artifact in the uh, threshold thing you can get rewards off of it that's also how you can get blueprints um, soothing balm to tame things like that another way you can actually get experience is by taming but I will do that in another video it doesn't give a lot of experience really so it's not really worth fooling with unless you want to get creature that you're looking for so those are ways that you can level up on art, get experience. Um, if you have any other ways, please comment below what those ways are. And I will maybe do a touch up to this tutorial to explain. But that's how I learned to level up. Um, it does get tough, but I feel that it's a fair way to get your character to a higher level. Do know that... If you have Primal Pass, you can level up much faster. It's just if you want to pay that 3 $4 a month 
or you can get a yearly subscription. I think it's like $34.99 or something like that. Um, that's entirely up to the player. I did have it, but because of problems that uh, Ark was having with lagging. If you notice in some of my videos, I still have a problem with lagging, and I have the S9. I just refuse to pay that until I can get a stable game. I hope that this video helped you in any kind of way to help you play better or if you're just start, starting out it gives you an idea of what to do so you don't go in blind. If you have any other questions please leave them in the comments. I do plan to do two more tutorials after this one. One for um, how to build things and one on um, taming. If you like this video, please like and subscribe if you haven't already done so. Hit that bell notification so you'll get notified every time that I uh, upload a new video. Thanks so much for watching.